hello guys welcome back to another video on the channel and in today's video I am very excited to start a new series and basically what this series is called is the vinyl broadcast now what the vinyl broadcast is is it's basically a series where I'm going to show you guys uh, records CDs anything like that but I'm also gonna do uh, stuff like talking about vinyl as well uh, so if you enjoy the series uh, and if you're excited to see what you know the series has to offer uh, be sure to leave a like down below and subscribe to the channel uh, so you don't miss out on the series but in today's uh, episode we are gonna be basically uh, sh showcasing some new uh, kiss records that I have uh, I got these today and uh, these are old pressings um, probably original uh, and I'm basically very excited to show them to you guys so uh, let's get straight into it so the first album that I'm going to be showcasing today is Just to Kill. It's Kiss's third album. Uh, it came out in 1975. Uh, here's the cover. I don't know how well you can see it because it's uh, kind of wrapped up right now. So, you know, in the plastic sleeve. Uh, but, uh, yeah, this album came out in 1975. I have an album review on this on the channel already, uh, so if you'd like to check that out to see my thoughts on the album, be sure to do that. Uh, but uh, I'm going to show you guys the record. Now, uh, one thing I will mention about this uh, particular copy that I found is that I do not believe this is the original sleeve uh, because this doesn't look like a Casablanca sleeve. So I, I believe, you know, whoever owned this... Um, this copy previously probably uh, just switched out the sleeve with a different sleeve that they you know had so yeah as you can see it's advertising you know other albums that I don't even think were on Casablanca like the record label so yeah uh, definitely uh, definitely interesting but here's the uh, here's the record and as I don't know if you can tell very well but uh, the album is in great condition. Uh, you know, barely any scratches at all. So yeah, it's really uh, epic for me. Uh, I'm glad to add it to the collection, and uh, you know, I'm really excited to have it. So definitely a cool find. So uh, let's move on to our next uh, album that we'll be showcasing to you guys today. All right, guys. So the next album I'm very excited to show you guys. Uh, I'm you know glad to get a copy of this, especially you know to get an original one. Uh, at that so uh it is none other than kiss destroyer uh yeah this is their um fourth studio album and uh there's it up close sorry about the microphone light it's kind of uh reflecting onto the uh, cover but hopefully you guys can see that well uh got the uh you know plastic sleeve on it to keep it uh nice and safe which is good uh, the vinyl is in near mint condition, which is great. Uh, now, this one uh, has this sleeve. It's a Casablanca sleeve, but I'm not sure if it's the original Destroyer sleeve. Um, from what I remember, like the original Destroyer sleeve like had the Kiss Army logo on it. Uh, I don't know if that's the case or not, but can you guys comment down below if uh, this is the original sleeve or if this maybe is like a, from a you know a certain country or like. A, was like a really old you know pressing i don't know uh please guys let me know it would really be uh appreciative if you could explain how you know what you think the sleeve is uh but yeah here's the uh here's the vinyl there's the uh the label as you can see this is uh side two right here um uh, but yeah definitely uh i'm glad to add that to my collection i think that's really uh you know cool addition uh, Destroyer's phenomenal album, and so is Just to Kill. Both phenomenal albums, you know, from Kiss's early days. I mean, you really can't beat it. And I, I was glad to find your know, originals on vinyl. Um, so yeah, uh, I know this was probably a pretty quick video, but I, you know, I wanted to, you know, find a way to start this uh, series. I'm really excited to, you know, see what this series, uh, you know, where it can go. I guess um, I'm really excited. So uh, yeah, if you guys enjoyed the first episode, be sure to leave a like down below. And uh, I will see you guys later. So, bye guys.